Turkey's largest and newest warship is on display in front of the palace of the country's old Ottoman rulers. The ship features prominently in President Recep Tayyip Erdogan's campaign, a symbol of the growing regional power of Turkey in a dangerous neighborhood. Regarding it, at the defense industry, regarding economy, regarding reconstruction and rehabilitation at the earthquake region, and showing a very strong foreign policy discourse with this, you know, a strong uh, statement uh, he wants to show to the public. And he will show, he will try to show that I am the man who can run the country under such a very, you know, the crisis period, international instability. Erdogan's strongman image is in stark contrast to his main challenger, Kamal Kulishtoğlu, a bookish retired civil servant who advocates consensus rather than confrontation and polarization, often addressing the nation from his kitchen table on YouTube. So what is important, you know, Mr. Kılıçdaroğlu is, you know, political stance itself. Mr. Kılıçdaroğlu is, during the last, you know, five years at least, he is trying to, you know, uh, build bridge between the different segments of the country. Kılıçdaroğlu has built a broad coalition of six parties, including secularists, Islamists and former Erdogan ministers on a platform of democratic reform and a return to parliamentary democracy. The election is taking place in the aftermath of February's deadly earthquakes, which claimed over 50,000 lives and saw heavy criticism of the government's response. But many see 40% plus inflation and a cost of living crisis as the most important issues in these polls. It's of course the economy, economy, economy. Economy is the uh, number one issue. Everyone has slid at least one class, all the uh, social cl economic classes have, have gone down. So everybody's feeling the bite of the economic crisis. Erdogan's two decade rule of his AKP party saw the emergence of the new powerful conservative middle class, which observers say has remained loyal until now. The AKP has a very, you know, very very solidified, um, you know, um, and old age uh, uh, electorate uh, from whom they've been getting votes for a very very long time, and to whom they they have been distributing the riches. Voters on Sunday face a choice between two men of sharply different character and vision for the future of Turkey in a poll widely predicted to be the closest in decades. Doreen Jones of VOA News, Istanbul.